Welcome back guys, Japan here once again and like I promised now we are moving on to go on wings um Torpter my absolute favorite mech I'm so insanely excited um there's just something about him his personality and everything that I just love and here's a stylized logo I mean I don't particularly not that these are bad but I you know his logo is not necessarily my favorite but his just I don't know I always like the idea of flying I like helicopters Chickens are cool. They taste good. <laughs> um, so, I don't know. I, there's just something about him. I think he works really, really nicely. And um, I like how, for the kind of rivalry that happens between Go On Jer and Go On Wings at first, I like how he's also some kind of bird. But he's like the flying bird, where Speedor's the, the ground bird. And it kind of adds to the little rivalry in the show. But, anyway, um, not a whole lot to them. Like all of them, they're pretty bricky. They are vehicles more so than animals, except for the faces, obviously. So uh, not a whole lot to do. Um, this does come off if, for whatever reason, you don't want him to have his propeller blades. He can maybe be... Uh, he looks kind of like a submarine to me. I don't know why without it. Um, but uh, you stick that on, and you just give it a spin. And now he can fly just like a helicopter. Not really. Don't throw your toys unless you want to. Um... <laughs> You can close them up, obviously, but that's uh, for a mode. You could pretend it's an attack, maybe. Like, he just kind of comes in and, tsh, I don't know. It's a big blade. Use your imagination. Um, he's got the very obvious speed or sunglasses right here. But if you ignore this bit, I, I kind of believe it. The the um, I keep saying chicken, but he's a rooster, technically. Um, I kind of believe that it's like the feather end of the... Um, of the chicken and and Torpter is a boy. I've seen lots of people say um, Torpter is a girl or Kaline's a girl. Or anything. Bear V is the only female engine. Everything else is dudes. So Torpter is a dude. Let's come to the back, squeeze the sides, pull the panel down, and let's see what sounds his engine sole makes. Very easy to bump it twice. There's where the LED is, and when you press the sides. Love that one. So one thing I realized I haven't been showing off is exactly um, where a lot of the buttons are. The buttons are right next to all of their faces. Because um, uh, I showed them off on Engino. Then uh, Burka, Gumford, and Carry Gator, I completely just spaced on that. There's one button on either side of the face. You press one, you get one sound like you saw me do. One, you get the other sound. And together, you get that... Like, like you get it over like a communicator or something, like um, a communications link. Um, you get that little right before um, when you push both of them together and that gives you one extra sound so this side does so many sounds this side does so many sounds and together they do the same sounds but then you get one extra um so i've i did forget to show that off so uh torpter it's right here on his little propeller not propellers this is a propeller on his little uh rocket tubes carry gator it's on the side of his face gumford it's on the side of his face again just carry gator's only one insight these little canisters right here you push them in for his i don't have his soul in um i don't have enough batteries to keep all their souls um talking at all times but whoops and once again we're going to take that out for transformation you can leave it in um of course it just if you bump it around it makes sounds for the sake of the review i'm going to leave it out but i do like to leave them in usually so for transformation we got even more simplified like engine is a pretty good transformation uh gun is a pretty good transformation the, the wings team got super simplified. You just take this off, flip it around, snap it back in the other way. And that's it. So now, next, what you got to do is bring in Engino, raise up the camera. And just like before, just make the G6 arms. Um, and then what you're going to do is very simply plug him in. And of course... Um, you can do whatever side you want 
show accuracy just like it was always Gumford on this side, Burka on this side for show accuracy. It's Torpter on this side all the time and Jetris on this side all the time. But nothing's stopping you from switching them up. Um, like, it's this isn't even the... Oh, you can't see that. This isn't even like the ugly side with all the screws in it. All the screws are on the bottom. So either side is like completely devoid of screws and neither side looks ugly. So you can easily switch sides um, and do whatever you want. Articulation has not changed. Of course, you can kind of do this and maybe he's shooting his uh, propellers because that is an attack he has. So all sorts of fun stuff you can do. Um, I love Torrupter. He's my absolute favorite. I'm trying not to like gush over him, but I just, I don't know why, I absolutely adore Torpter, and uh, he never combined like this with Engino just by himself, it was only with Jetris, but again, your toys, your imagination, nothing's really stopping you, so this would, I guess, technically be Engino Torpter. Um, so in the next video review, we'll take a peek at Jetris, and then we'll have almost the complete Wings team, almost. See you next time, guys. A lot of the buttons are, the buttons are right next to all of their faces um uh because i showed them off on engino then uh burka gumford and carry gator i completely just spaced on that there's one button on either side of the face you press one you get one sound like you saw me do one you get the other sound and together you get that like like you get it over like a communicator or something like um a communications link um you get that little right before um, when you push both of them together and that gives you one extra sound so this side does so many sounds this side does so many sounds and together they do the same sounds but then you get one extra um, so I've, I did forget to show that off so uh, Torpter it's right here on his little propeller not propellers this is a propeller on his little uh, rocket tubes carry gator it's on the side of his face Gumford is on the side of his face again just carry gator is the only one in sight Bear V is the only female engine Everything else is dudes. So Torpter is a dude. Let's come to the back, squeeze the sides, pull the panel down, and let's see what sounds his engine sole makes. Very easy to bump it twice. There's where the LED is, and when you press the sides. Love that one. So one thing I realized I haven't been showing off is exactly um, where faces, obviously. So uh, not a whole lot to do. Um, this does come off if for whatever reason you don't want him to have his propeller blades. He can maybe be... Uh, he looks kind of like a submarine to me. I don't know why without it. Um, but uh, you stick that on and you just give it a spin. And now he can fly just like a helicopter. Not really. Don't throw your toys unless you want to. <laughs> um, you can close them up, obviously, but that's uh, for a mode. You could pretend it's an attack, maybe. Like he just kind of comes in and, tsh, I don't know. It's a big blade. Use your imagination. <laughs> um He's got the very obvious speed or sunglasses right here, but if you ignore this bit, I I kind of believe it. The the um, I keep saying chicken, but he's a rooster technically. Um, I kind of believe that it's like the feather end of the um, of the chicken. And and Torpter is a boy. I've seen lots of people say um, Torpter's a girl or Kaline's a girl. Or anything. Welcome back, guys. Japan me here. Once again, and like I promised, now we are moving on to go on wings. Um, Torpter, my absolute favorite mecha. I'm so insanely excited. Um, there's just something about him, his personality and everything that I just love. And here's a stylized logo. I mean, I don't particularly, not that these are bad, but I, you know. His logo is not necessarily my favorite, but his just, I don't know. I always like the idea of flying. I like helicopters. Chickens are cool. They taste good. <laughs> um, so I don't know. There's just something about him. I think he works really, really nicely. And um, I like how for the kind of rivalry that happens between Go On Jer and Go On Wings at first, I like how he's also some kind of bird, but he's like the flying bird where Speedor is the, the ground bird. And it kind of adds to the little rivalry in the show. But anyway... 
Um, not a whole lot to them. Like all of them, they're pretty bricky. They are vehicles more so than animals, except for these little canisters right here. You push them in for his. I don't have his soul in. Um, I don't have enough batteries to keep all their souls um, talking at all times. But, whoops. And once again, we're going to take that out for transformation. You can leave it in. Um, of course, it just if you bump it around, it makes sounds. For the sake of the review, I'm going to leave it out, but I do like to leave them in usually. So for transformation, we got even more simplified. Like, Engino is a pretty good transformation. Uh, Gunborough is a pretty good transformation. The, the Wings team got super simplified. You just take this off, flip it around, snap it back in the other way, and that's it. So now... Next, what you got to do is bring in Engino, raise up the camera, and just like before, just make the G6 arms. Um, and then what you're going to do is very simply plug him in, and of course, 